Okay, what is up guys, Gooey Games here from Tomahawk HQ and The Rising Games. Today I'm here with two cool pieces of tech you can pick up for $5 and below. So, one of these that you have to get on Amazon, it's going to be hard to find in store, which I don't think there is. And this, the first one you can actually get from your typical dollar store or possibly even five below. So, one of these. Now, yes, my school has these. These are actually really common. Now, for the people who are in my school, they're going to be saying, Oh, you stole that. Oh, didn't you steal that? No, I bought this from Five Below. I mean, they have these. If you don't know what these are, I think it's on... So, I think we both know newer computers have only one. One 3.5 millimeter headphone jack. And for the people who were live more back in the day older headphones when headphones first started becoming a common thing they had two ports like these well not like this but two 3.5 millimeter headphone jacks one of them was designed for the mic and one of them was designed for the headphones but most people use the headphones for certain things and other people use the mic for other certain things so this is problem solved it, let's say you have you just found an older pair of headphones in your closet or wherever you keep your stuff and you said oh let me try it but your new computer only has one 3.5 millimeter jack this is an easy fix and it's good for testing out how they worked i mean if you plug this in your computer right now just plug this in you know the actual headphones like this part is the earbuds, or like the actual headphones, and then this one is for the mic. So, it will be basically two-in-one, so you don't have to worry about having two of the traditional 3.5 millimeter headphone jacks things. So, let's put this aside. And this set will be in five below, definitely. You can definitely go pick one up. They might not be the same design as this. They might be a little longer, shorter. I don't know, maybe in a different color. No pun intended. Um, so let's put that aside, and now this one is for definitely old rare computers. If you all know what this is, this may look like a regular, this is, this is um, not a micro USB port. This is a fatter version of the micro USB port, usually used on older phones, such as maybe a flip phone. This is not like any ordinary charger, like you traditionally see, like this. Do I have one in here? Like your traditional micro USB port. As you can see, you know, this is the side where you plug into your brick, and then this is the side where you plug into the phone or iPad or whatever you use, and it would start charging. Yes, it's traditional micro USB or charger. But this is something different. So, if you were alive back in the day when computers first started becoming a thing. Oh, shoot. My headphone was hanging out when I kind of closed the door. Hopefully it still works. Oh my. Okay, whatever. So if you're alive back in the day, you know what these ports are. Now, you can actually find these ports on the Nintendo Game Boy Color and Game Boy Advance. Now, we all know these ports were on computers. Now. They weren't every single computer. I believe the, there was one Mac that had it. But there are there used to be computers that used to have this kind of port. And now, I'm going to be completely honest with you. I don't exactly know what it's called. But anyway. That other piece right there, we'll get to that in a minute. So, it was basically, this kind of port was used for file sharing. Kind of like USB. But see, older computers did not have USB. They, were, they always used traditionally floppy disks. But if you're lucky, you can find a computer with this, and people use this for file sharing. But never mind this at the moment. So let's get back to the main part. So we all know what this is, right? You now we got this right here, you know, charging right there. Look in the back of this. It's an adapter. So if you basically plug this in, okay, I don't, personally, I don't have an older computer which has this kind of port. Um, maybe I can get it one day for you guys and I can show you what it does, but basically you plug this into your computer and 
this is you have to buy it on Amazon. I'm sadly it's not in like your traditional Five Below, Target, Walmart, or even the dollar store. This was four dollars and fifty cents. You can go pick this up on Amazon. Um, like I said, I don't know what this is called, but it's definitely to a USB connector. So, like I was saying before, this isn't just any traditional USB port that you plug into your brick and charge. This is an actual USB. It's disguised to look like one of like one of a charger to make it look unique. So there are three versions of this. One is one is eight gigabytes gigabytes. The other is sixteen gigabytes, and the other is thirty two. This is the sixteen gigabytes. So basically, if you have an, if you found your old computer and it has one of these kinds of ports, and you have a new computer, and let's say you have some old files on that old computer you want to put on your new computer. So, you plug this into your old computer, plug this into your new computer, and it works just like a USB, but wired. So anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this quick little video. This definitely is worth it. These two are definitely worth it. And if you want to see more stuff like this, please comment down below and like this video, and possibly drop a subscribe. Yeah. But anyway, yes, these are two things. You can find this at 5 below for the $4. It's at $3 and $4 depending on how it looks and the color. This, you have to get on Amazon. The final price is $4.50. There's no up, there's no down. And this is including tax. So, um, I'll actually tell you this took um, three days to arrive. I mean, it is definitely worth it if you have older computers. But anyway... I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Have a good Saturday night. See you later.